everyone welcome back to Money Monday now this video I've made is more so for young people um, particularly students and I've made this video because you guys have requested it and you've been so patient because you've been asking me for this video for a very long time now just because you're a student you know you're you're studying you know you've got college fees or university fees or you know tertiary education costs doesn't mean that you need to delay investing Sure, cash flow is you know probably tight. You know you're trying to focus on passing your all your exams and get assignments in on time. But just because you're a student doesn't mean you don't need to invest. If anything, starting earlier in life when it comes to investing is probably one of the best things you can do for yourself. And if you watch my video on my story, you'll know that I actually started investing when I was in my, I think my first year of university, when I was studying full time and I was working part time pulling beers at one of my local bars. Anyway, I have designed a strategy for you. It's an investing strategy and it's going to help, I guess, create some potential financial security or a better financial future for yourself. I'm going to show you how regularly investing just a small amount of money each week can grow over a long period of time and potentially provide you with a lot more financially harmonious future. Now for this investment strategy I've come up with a few key assumptions. The first one is I'm using an average long-term return of 8% per annum. I've also assumed that that interest rate is compounded monthly. So here's the strategy. So say you're 18 years old and you start with $1,000. Now you might be thinking, hang on Kanna, where am I going to come up with $1,000? Well you can go to the Sugar Mama website and read about how I have come up with multiple piles or um, bundles of $1,000 for the $1,000 project. Now, you take that $1,000 and you invest it and you also invest $30 per week for two years. So from the age of 18 through to age 20, you've invested $1,000 initially and $30 per week. When you turn 20, you then contribute another $1,000. You also increase that regular investment plan of $30 per, per week to $60 per week. You continue this strategy, don't change anything and reinvest all the dividends and let it just sit there and grow over time for 10 years. You then add another $1,000 and again you double your regular contribution plan from $60 per week to $120 per week. From this point forward you do nothing else. You don't sell anything, you buy and hold for the long run and you reinvest all growth and dividends or, or passive income created from the investment. You let it sit there and let compound interest do its magic. Now, using the compounding interest calculator, you should have a portfolio worth $1.44 million by age 60. Now, as you know from watching my videos, having good healthy um, cash flow management is about having a very healthy habit system in place. I guarantee if you set a regular savings plan as small as $30 per week or even $10 per week if that's all you could afford at this point in time and you slowly increase it over time, this is a very, very powerful way of you know, allowing your portfolio to grow over the long run and through an additional contribution plan and having compounding interest become even more powerful for you. These very simple little steps over the long run are going to really help increase your financial future and financial abundance. This is just food for thought, it's not advice, but it's something definitely worth considering. I'm going to include the link in the description below of a calculator that you can play around with and see what you're capable of earning over the long run. So do not delay for a second investing. Anyone can do this. You might want to use something like a managed fund um, or instead of shares, but it's completely up to you. Continue on building your knowledge before you make any decisions, but always consider this as a possibility if you're young and keen to start building up a better financial future for yourself. Anyway, that's it for this video. Don't forget you can follow me on Instagram at sugarmama.tv. You can like us on Facebook. And please keep your requests coming. I am trying to make them as quickly as possible for you. I've got a long list of people, you know, with all sorts of different video ideas that they'd like to send to me. And I love hearing from you, so that's great. But ciao for now, and I'll see you next Monday on Money Monday. Ciao!